Hyper Chef, we're going to make eggplant towers. This is a new creation of mine. I've taken an eggplant, skin on, I've washed it, and I've sliced it relatively thin. As you can see, I've dipped them in an egg wash, just beaten egg, and then breadcrumb. That's all we're doing. I'm gonna cover them up really good, and then I'm going to lightly fry them. And then after they have cooled, we're gonna come back and assemble these towers, which will feature eggplant, uh, tomatoes, mozzarella, basil, and a balsamic drizzle. So I'm just gonna drop these in now, and I'm not gonna bore you with watching me fry them, but I'm going to fry them now. Let's see if that's nice and almost ready. Mm. It's got the bubbles. New stove, getting used to it. Okay. All right, so we're gonna fry these when they're golden brown. I'm gonna flip them, you want them to be nice and tender. And when we come back, we'll assemble the eggplant towers. Ahead. Okay, so now we're going to assemble our eggplant towers. So the tomato has been sliced and had put salt on it. So what we're going to do is I'm going to put the tomato like that. I'm going to put the mozzarella over the top. I'm going to put a piece of basil. And this is balsamic reduction. You take the balsamic vinegar, you bring it to a boil, and you cook it for five to eight minutes, and you make a little drizzle out of it. Ooh. So we're just going to assemble these. It makes a nice, festive, fancy looking appetizer. You can make them as, as high as you want to make them. You don't have to do one level, you can do multiple levels. And serve them like that, people put them on their plate, they slice them, and they're absolutely delicious. Okay, fresh mozzarella is best. Uh, I've grabbed the galbani, the pre-sliced, but of course, if you get it from the pork store, of course, let it come to room temperature before you use it. It's easier to slice that way. And I'm gonna make a couple more of these so my company's coming through the door any minute. Put a little basil on this, put a little more. A little balsamic drizzle. And we are good to go. So I'm gonna make one more. And as we like to say here on the Hyper Chef, Look at that, isn't that beautiful? So I like to say here, Maja con bon gusto.